Twitter, Instagram block Kanye West over anti-Semitic posts. Kanye West once suggested slavery was a choice. He called the COVID-19 vaccine the mark of the beast. Earlier this month, he was criticized for wearing a White Lives Matter t-shirt to his collection at Paris Fashion Week. Now the rapper who is legally known as Yee is again embroiled in controversy, locked out of Twitter and Instagram over anti-Semitic posts that the social networks said Sunday violated their policies. In one post on Twitter, Yee said he would soon go dead. Con 3 on Jewish people, according to Internet Archive records, making an apparent reference to the U.S. Defense Readiness Condition Scale known as DEFCON. You guys have toyed with me and tried to blackball anyone who ever opposes your agenda, he said in the same tweet posted late Saturday, which was removed by Twitter. The comment drew a sharp rebuke from the Anti-Defamation League, which called the tweet deeply troubling, dangerous, and anti-Semitic, period. There is no excuse for his propagating of white supremacist slogans and classic anti-Semitism about Jewish power, especially with the platform he has, a statement said. Yee has alienated even ardent fans in recent years, teasing and long tinkering with albums that haven't been met with the critical or commercial success of his earlier recordings. Those close to him, like ex-wife Kim Kardashian and her family, have ceased publicly defending him after the couple's bitter divorce and his unsettling posts about her recent relationship with comedian Pete Davidson. Davidson. But the social media lockouts cap a whirlwind week for Yi, even by his standards. On October 3, he wore a White Lives Matter t-shirt while debuting his latest fashion line in Paris, prompting harsh criticism. According to the Southern Poverty Law Center, which tracks hate groups, White Lives Matter is a neo-Nazi group. Yi has earned a reputation less for his music and more for stirring up controversy since 2016, when he was hospitalized in Los Angeles because of what his team called stress and exhaustion. It was later revealed that he had been diagnosed with bipolar disorder. That year, he ended a show in Sacramento, California, after just four songs but not before a 10-minute tirade about Beyoncé, Jay-Z, Hillary Clinton, Mark Zuckerberg, the radio, and MTV. West soon decided to scrap the entire tour. Yes, involvement aside, social media restrictions like this incident have been largely routine for the platforms. Twitter took action on nearly 4.3 million accounts between July and December of 2021, the latest available available data from a transparency report it publishes twice a year. About 1.3 million accounts were suspended in the same period. While there is still hateful content on Twitter, the company has spent years trying to detect and remove threats, abuse, racism, violence, and other harmful material.